for daily ask reddit what is the worst notification you have received whilst someone else has had your phone was showing my mum some cake ideas for my wife's 30th that I was considering. My wife texted me and my mum, for unknown reasons, got a full view of my wife's spoon with the caption, guess what you're eating for dessert tonight. I tried to grab my phone back, and my mum went back to browsing cakes without skipping a beat. As I was leaving my mum thought it would be funny to ask, would you like second dessert tonight, because I have a trifle in the fridge. I nearly died of shame. This happened to my friend, I sent him a text of a wet cat, and said look at this wet pussy, while my other friend's mom was holding his phone. She just awkwardly gave him his phone back. That's what friends are for. Years ago I was working at an Apple store as a genius, technician, and was helping an older woman with her phone. This woman had to be in her late 60s early 70s, as sweet as could be, and was having some minor issues with her phone, I think it was battery life or something. So she hands me her phone, and just as she does a message pops up with a picture of a toilet full of shit and the message reads how many times do I have to tell you to flush the fun toilet? Not knowing really what to do I just hand it back to her, and tell her she has a message. She takes the phone. Half smiles, closes the message and hands it back saying, sorry about that sweetheart, my daughter can be a bit of a bitch. A couple of years ago met a guy from Tinder in a pub for our first date. Things were going well, we were having a laugh and flirting. After about an hour I took out my phone to show him a funny meme, and up popped a notification from my new period tracking app saying today's the day, you're ovulating. I swiped it real quick, and I don't think he got a good look at it, but I was still worried he'd think I was some child obsessed weirdo who timed my dates, so random tinder guys could impregnate me. I turned off ovulation notifications after that. Edit, and I was a sender once, when I text my friend who was planning to break up with her bf hope you're okay, how did Gari take the breakup? When Gari was using her phone, and hadn't yet been broken up with. Sorry Gari. Other way around, I was holding ex-husband's phone, while he was driving me, and the kids to the airport. Text comes in from a work colleague asking, if we'd left yet. It was then, that I realized the marriage was over. I was the one doing the sending. I moved to Japan a couple of years ago, and early one morning I was at a market, and saw a Tanuki statue that had the full kakken balls on display. I took a picture of it, and thought it would be funny to send my brother a message reading unsolicited do ck pic. Then send a pic of the Tanuki statue. Little did I know, halfway around the world, my brother was doing some late evening car shopping. He had recently been in an accident that had totaled his car, and was in the market for a new one. He had handed the car salesman his phone, so he could show the guy the pics of the damage to his car and the guy was looking through them, when the words unsolicited do ck pic popped up on the screen. My brother said the guy nearly dropped the phone trying to shove it back in his hands. Not my notification, but I sent to my best girlfriend you're right, future husband's dad is weird and a little racist, and her future husband saw the text. Luckily he laughed and agreed with me, but I was so embarrassed that he saw it. My cell was staying with me for a week, which I wasn't stoked about. My sister knew about it, and messaged me how, are you dealing with, cell's name? Do you need to pretend to have an app again lol? Unfortunately my cell was borrowing my tablet at the time, and saw the notification pop up. She hasn't stayed with us since. Many years ago my Zill made a facebook post about that moment, when you can't even stand a person anymore. It was very vague, but she had not left the house all day, and it was mostly just me and her. Pretty sure the post was about me. I never did ask her about it, but if I remember correctly I did give it a like. <laughs>